very complex way. Gravity is this huge effect and it can go over long distances. The solar system has a huge vibrant past. The giants have moved and interacted. It's really remarkable how interconnected all these planetary bodies really are, even though we think of them as very separate. This interaction between planets billions of miles apart transformed the inner solar system and primed Earth for life. But our planet was still uninhabitable. The early Earth, right after Von Bogman, would have been a complete hellscape. It would have been really hot magma everywhere, big impact craters with impact melt all across the floors. It would have been unrecognizable. Not only was it incredibly hot, but it also didn't have an atmosphere. And at the time, there was no liquid water on the surface. Early Earth could not have supported life. For life to start, Earth must cool down and build a new atmosphere. The Earth developed a second atmosphere using materials delivered by the great bombardment. All of these molecules, like water and carbon, organic materials, were incorporated into the Earth's crust. And then volcanoes were able to outgap all of these materials, forming a very thick layer of water. 